ready yep. to start ready. adjusting? Yep. Awesome. Yep. 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 All right. Ken is going to demonstrate how to take a reading with the Secchi disc. We are located on East Reservoir, which is part of the Portage Lakes system in Ohio. And Portage Lakes is part of our program. We have information on several of the lakes here in this system on the online site. To take a Secchi disc reading, you first have to go to the shady side of the boat. We usually take the readings in the deepest part of the lake, if it's a reservoir that's down by the dam. The shady side of the boat is where the reading is taken, and you lower the Secchi disc until it just disappears, which Ken is going to demonstrate. Okay, so there, that's, nope. All right, so there's the disc down there, huh? Wow, look at that. All right, so you lower the disc until it just disappears from sight, and you mark at the surface with the, with a the clip. Then you lower the disc about another foot, and you start to raise the disc again until it just reappears. Mark it with a clip. The actual reading is measured at the midpoint between those two clips. To find the midpoint, you can take the two clips and put them together and you're finding the midway point. Remove one clip and put the other clip where you have measured the midpoint. The actual measurement, you use a ruler and it is recorded in inches, to the nearest inch. So from the disc up, so this would be one foot, 12 inches and then from here to here. So that'd be 20 inches. Okay. To take the water color, you want to use half the Secchi disc. So you need to measure the midway point by taking your marked clip from the Secchi disc reading and half the rope. Lower the Secchi disc half, the Secchi disc reading. Place the color chart on the surface of the water and compare the color chart to the white quadrants on the disc. Like so, okay. Use that chart to determine what number that you would give that water, whether it be in the greens or in the browns. So for today, we're looking at one or two, right? A little bit of green. Cool. To take water temperature, we're going to collect water at one foot depth. That's using a container that comes in the kit. If you lower it upside down into the water, the length of the string and turn it up, you're going to collect water at that depth. Place the thermometer into the container, Put it in a shady area, let it stabilize, and then take the reading in degrees Fahrenheit. All of this information is recorded on a data form. 
where we have the Secchi disc. That reading is taken twice and then an average is recorded from the two readings. And then information on color, watercolor, temperature, and also what the waves are like today using numbers one, two, three, and four with one being very, very calm and four being white caps. This would probably be a three today. It's choppy, fairly windy today. Fairly windy, yeah. And then we also asked some other information. What is the water quality like today? How many people are using the boat? What water management techniques have been used? Lake water management? Right. What's the trash like? Right. What's the algae like? What about the weeds? We get a general idea of what the water quality, what the perception is from the volunteer and what the water quality is like. That information then, the data form is sent into the Ohio Lake Management Society and then the information is put on the online system. Cool. Cool. Well, thanks for the demo, Ken. That concludes our and Dana, water monitoring Dana, test. Dana, sure. thank you so much.